confuse us enough. Okay. 40 years ago, Eleanor had her first brain tumor. Uh, since that time, she's had three. That's why she's totally deaf. What started out as uh, acoustic aerobics ended up as neurofibromatosis. <clears throat> Charlie Drake took the first tumor off uh, 40 years ago. The method used at that time was astronomical. The patient was spun around, the dye was put into the system trying to locate the tumor. It was located, of course, on the acoustic side of the left part of her head. That's why her face is totally paralyzed on that side. The other two tumors came along in, 18, in 1988. We went to Pittsburgh and had the gamma knife. Maybe you've never heard of a gamma knife. That's a heavy dose of radiation. And uh, the tumors were done that way. Uh, in 89, we were sitting in Centennial Hall, and uh, she went deaf sitting there. She said, I can see them clapping, but I can't hear them. And uh, what we had hoped would be to save her hearing, it didn't. Anyway, uh, she has been totally deaf now for the last 40 years. I'm sorry, 20 years. I'm getting ahead of myself. This goes with old age. <laughs> it's not funny, McGee. <laughs> Anyway, this, is, this has been the history as far as we're concerned, and this is one reason why that we do support this whole operation. The 23rd of, this, of July, uh, they took my heart out and put in a new valve. Uh, we also had a bypass done, and uh, here I'm standing. I turned to you one on the uh, 6th of October. We had our 59th wedding anniversary on the 13th. Uh, as I said, you don't ever get that for murder. However, here we are. And this is one reason why we support it and calling you don't use is enough. I will make a note of that. <laughs> we, I think we just did. 